As one of the learning objectives for this course is to integrate a Node.js project with a GitHub repository, we thought that right now would be a good time to take our project and get it set up with a new Git repo so we can start tracking the progress of our project with Git. So if you do not have github.com account, please set one up so you can stay in parallel. You could obviously do this on Bitbucket or any other Git type of site, but if you want to stay in direct parallel with the course, we're going to do this all on GitHub. So again, if you don't have a GitHub account, go ahead and go out to github.com, set up an account, use a username that's easy to remember and easy to type, not too long, always makes things easier. Then come back here and let's get our new project set up on a GitHub repo. So the easy process for getting all of our new content into our Git repository is to first open a new terminal. And we can see that we are at our project root. And the first thing we want to do is do a git init to set our project up for working with Git. We've done that. Mine says reinitialized because I've done it before. Yours probably won't say that. It should say a successful message. The next thing we want to do is add everything into our git repo index. And that's done by doing a git add space period. And that means take everything and stick it into the repo staging area. And we've done that. To see what's staged now and ready to be committed into our repo, we can do a git status command. We can see on branch master our initial commit is set up with all of these files. We can see that everything in our client directory is included. And then we've got our node project app.js file here and our package.json file, which is here, and our server.js file, which is here. We've got everything that we need. This is not including the node modules directory because those are static resources that are being managed by Bower, that will be managed by Bower. We'll get into that. And what we've got here on our staging list looks legitimate. So what we can do then is a git commit. So we use the command git commit. And we go into the editor where we want to enter our comment. That's always easy. The first one is initial commit. That seems to work pretty well. And then we can do a control X to get out of the editor. Answer yes to save modified buffer. Hit enter and our commit is complete. And the final step to get our commit pushed up to our Git repository in the cloud, we need to use the command git push and then use the URL of your individual repo. Mine happens to be https colon forward slash forward slash github.com aloha code. And then another for slash, and I need to provide a name for this repo. And I'll just simply call this node project. You can see I added after my username, node project. And when I hit enter, my username, which is Aloha code, my password, and the repository was not found. So what that means is I need to go out to my GitHub account. This is the easiest way to do this. Go to the root of my account and you can see that here in the URL. There is just my username and I can go to repositories and choose new. Create a new repository and here's where I can say node project. And I can put a little description in here. And I can just leave that public and leave all of the other options there and hit create repository. Excellent. Now I can go back here and using the up arrow, I get last command that I used. I can now 
enter that username. And you can see it says counting objects 19. It's using some compression, blah, blah, blah. And it's up there. I can go check to see that everything is there. And I can click here on my node project. And I can see that everything's uploaded. There's server, there's package.json. Here's our node project with app.js in it. And of course, we got our client directory here, which has some cool stuff, but um, nothing that we need to worry about yet. So we go back here. We can see that we've got a complete Git repo set up, and we've done our initial commit and our initial push to our Git repo in the cloud, and we are in good shape.